Today we're going to show a Scotchman CPO 315 HFA CNC automatic cold saw. I'm going to show the, the setup, uh, change diameters of tubing, and change some different lengths. First we're going to use an inch and a half diameter tubing. Just set my vices. Just open them up. Close them. Tighten it down on the material. Open. For this tubing, I got a couple clicks uh, more than hand tight. I want to go to the auto screen, and I want to cut this job at 40 RPM. I'm going to cut eight and a half inch lengths and two of those. So I'm set up there. I want to advance my material just past my blade to do a trim cut. Hit the trim set cycle button. I have to control my feed down through the material to blow the control valve. There's my trim. Okay, now I have my job complete. I have two pieces eight and a half inches long cut. If I decide now that I want a six inch long piece, I can punch that in. Um, only want one of those. I don't have to do the trim cycle start now because it's already clamped and ready to go, so I just hit cycle start. It'll advance my six inch part and make the cut. Now I want to set up on one inch size material. So go in the manual screen. Put my one inch material in. Set my vices again. Go to auto. Now I want to cut this job at 130 RPM. And let's make four inch pieces. And I want to make uh, three of those. So again, I advance it slightly past the blade. Job is complete. You can also store jobs. I'm on single profile now, but I can have uh, up to 50 products saved, and I can cut up to four different lengths of different quantities in each product. The Scotchman CPO 315 HFA CNC automatic cold saw.